An elderly Perth father has spoken about his crash ordeal after the ambulance rushing him to hospital was slammed into and flipped. Gerald Stokes was already in a critical condition when he was knocked unconscious in the smash. Tonight, he has a warning for other drivers. Battered and bruised in a hospital bed, Gerald Stokes can still crack a smile despite being stuck upside down in this ambulance when it was hit and flipped in Rockingham. That is a car accident. Its ambulance got hit by another car. I'm still here, I'm still alive. The 75-year-old was knocked unconscious on impact. And also there is somebody inside the ambulance because okay, it is, uh, right, the sirens so was on. It's car versus ambulance, is it? Yes, yes, yep. the ambulance was about to go past the intersection. All right. Escaping with just a cut to his ear and arm. I feel lucky, without the photograph of the ambulance, I feel lucky to be here in the first place. He was being rushed to hospital with an emergency ulcer condition yesterday afternoon when another car slammed into the side of the ambulance on Ennis Avenue. The part of the crash I do not remember. I just remember old people and firemen standing around me. Uh, with a back brace and a neck collar on. Coming into hospital, the father of two says paramedics had to tell him he'd been in a crash. The last vehicle you would think you'd be in <laughs> on an accident was an ambulance. <laughs> the driver of the other car wasn't hurt, neither was the doctor inside the ambulance, but one of the two paramedics suffered a shoulder injury and are now on medical leave. Everyone involved in the crash will be interviewed by police, who say it's still too soon to tell whether any charges will be laid. But Gerald still has this message for drivers. I mean, anyone can say an ambulance. They must slow down. Michael Stamp, Nine News.